David Armitage, Nunes, who's kicked the goal already. Tough oh. one here. How hard was that? Australian football is our national sport. You know, it's, it's such a spectacular, dynamic game, and it's just, um, you know, it's something that everyone gets into, and some of the greatest players that ever played have, have been Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islanders. And the, the Indigenous round began as a celebration of the contribution that those players have made to the game over those years. Every club would have a specific jersey that they would have on that weekend, and they would usually partner with, um, with a famous artist um, to create something which was related to that club and, and the communities that they work with for, um, for finding talent. And, uh, and, and it's, it's just grown from there. Growing up uh, here on, on Badu was hard, you know, like uh, if you wanted to eat, you have to catch it. And I guess I'm lucky to have been born in that era because uh, I fluently speak my lingo and it is a, 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 a dying um, thing for us and we're trying to uh, keep the language alive, which is our identity. Art is it's important to the Torres Strait Islander people because it's it's a documentation of our way of life, our traditional practices, our stories, and the the the, the lore of the the lore of the land, the lore of the islands. The biggest uh, representation out of uh, the indigenous round is that uh, we are getting recognised as the First Nation people. The design on the jersey at the front here is, is uh, this is the aim pose. So it's when it spots an opportunity, um, it's uh, it, it gets into this pose. So it stops in one place and it's 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 fast and it's accurate. It looks like it's proud of what it does. So the Adelaide Football Club jumper reflects our journey. It, talks about the foundations and where we've come from, our strong past, um, our culture, and also a bit about our, our journey moving forward. So to be able to partner with someone like Trek, who their passion was about bringing people together um, by the way of bikes, um, similar to, you know, we use footy as a vehicle to bring people together to achieve great things. someone came up with a suggestion, well, why don't we do a Project One bike that could be a representative of the Adelaide Crows Guernsey for the Indigenous round. And then we can use that to, to auction off and to raise money for the, um, for the particular um, communities that the Adelaide Crows work with. And so that was where the project began. And um, the two artists, we had a, a, an artist from Waterloo, Wisconsin, 14,000 miles away as the crow flies, working with Laurie Nona who created the, um, who created the jersey. And um, together they were able to adapt that amazing design and put it onto the carbon fibre tubes of the Trek road bike. I was sent a really great story about the design that was incorporated in by the artist in Adelaide. It's talking a bit about the conflicts that this bird kind of runs through in its journey and that is also representing the indigenous people. What makes Project One so, so unique is that you've got access to just an unlimited range of paints, finishes. Um, you've got an idea and a concept and Project One is available to see that through. To have something that travels and is seen by a lot of people and is part of something good is awesome. That's why designers do what they do. Through the Crows Children's Foundation, we've decided to use the bike in a charity ride. Everyone that's um, donated to the cause uh, goes in the, into, the, um, into the draw, basically, to, to win a bike. This amazing bike that Trek have designed, so um, it's a bit of our way of giving back as well, so not just um, people giving to us, but us giving back as part of that, um, I guess, the community role. 